y'all welcome or welcome back to my channel as you already know or if you don't know my name is robin and as you can tell by the title today i'm going to be showing you all how you can get these beautiful long lasting rope twists so to start off i used two packs of expression braiding hair in the color number two um there's over 20 plus twists in my head so two packs is a decent amount Then I go in with my edge control and sleek it all around the four corners of my part so that the beginning of my twist will be ready to style. I just wanted to say that that edge control, that specific edge control does not flake. Um, I know it may look like it's white or that it's flaking, but it's really not. It's just the edge control and the grease that is mixed that makes it look that way. So after you've done all of that, depending on the length that you want your twist to be, that is the length that you will cut your expression hair. Then you will split a decent amount from your section, not too thick but not too skinny either. And once you've achieved that, you will wrap that strand around your natural hair. Then. You add some edge control to your natural hair to tame the flyaways and bond the two strands of your natural hair and expression hair together. That way, your three strands will now turn into two. Continuing this process, twist the two strands until you feel like they are tight enough to your liking and do the other side the same way. Now, as you are twisting the strands down to form your twist, this process is a twist on twist motion. So as you are twisting down, you have to twist each strand to hold the rope effect. So twist and twist, like, I don't know how to explain it really good, but as you can see what I'm doing, you have to twist each strand so that your twist can hold together When you've gotten down to the end of your twist, make sure that you secure it with the rubber band. I'm going to fast forward this upcoming clip just because it's the repeated process of what I just did. Now that you are done, make sure that you clip all of your flyaways and dip your hair in boiling hot waters so it won't be sticking out everywhere and it will just lay flat on your head. <music> 
to finish off your look add mousse just to define your hair and you know make it stand out a little bit more i didn't have any mousse like the foam but i had mousse spray so i just used that and then styled my hair so this is the finished look i hope you all enjoyed this video and found it very helpful make sure that you're subscribed and i will see you all in the next video